Many financial advisors shy away from video marketing because they fear it may be difficult with compliance. But there are a lot of ways you can show your authentic self and value proposition to gain new clients while being approved by compliance. This video is the basic do's and don'ts along with what equipment you need to get started with video marketing as a financial advisor. Hi, Taylor here at Financial Potion, where video is your financial potion. And to never miss out on a video, please make sure you subscribe to our channel and click on the bell to get notified every Friday at 5 p.m. Arizona time that a new video has been posted. And for one-to-one -one training, please click above and connect with us on our Patreon page. Pre-production is key, so plan out the videos you want to do first and take note of what you can and can't talk about. Market updates referencing PDFs you can share are acceptable and show you have a pulse on the state of the market. History lessons of what has happened in the past, as long as it's completely factual, is fine. Who you are as a person and why you love the industry is fine, as long as you don't make claims or promises or have cheesy dollar signs everywhere. Now, for recording, you really don't need to be that fancy. Talking head videos, unless you want to get fun from time to time, is all you need. So to get started, you need a camera, which could be your phone or web camera. If you're using your phone, you can get a ring light that is also a cell phone holder. If you're using the web camera, you'll want to get a ring light or something equivalent as well. For audio, determine the look you want to have. Small lapel or podcast mic. And purchase an external mic that will work best for you. Don't be afraid of video marketing. It's a great way to add value to your current client base and bring in new clients. If you need any help getting started, please click on the link to schedule a complimentary strategy session.